guys, I hope you're having a great Friday. Um, I just wanted to do a quick video about a new hackamore that I got. Um, it is a wheel hackamore. Uh, the one I actually got was a flower hackamore, um, but there are different types of wheel hackamores. <laughs> <laughs> that's Arthur um uh, there is like the wheel the um wheel one which is like um a star hackamore which is like kind of like spokes on a bicycle and then flower is more sort of what I got which is like a little flower design um and yeah we're gonna see how um Maverick does with it um and uh yeah just uh in my tack room right now getting ready um and I'll do a little tack room tour uh probably pretty soon here but uh yeah so this is it on the bridle um as you can see um it's set up in sort of the lower position um if you're up here there is like no leverage because you're just sort of pulling straight back um maybe like a tiny amount but nothing nothing you know really significant down here as you pull back it sort of swings upward um like this so try and show you guys so it's, as you can see it kind of swings um so there's a little more leverage there uh, which i'm going to try with arthur because um he needs a little bit more communication um i probably will be just fine up here with um with maverick so because uh, he is a pro at britless bridles and he loves them so we will see a bit of the fuzzies are coming off here <laughs> high quality tack <laughs> So we just got done riding um, and I actually really liked it. Um, I think it worked really well. Um, I felt like there was more communication with him. Uh, okay, yeah, he thinks so too. I think it could maybe use like a couple more holes for him um, on the nose band because it's a little bit loose as you can see. So I might just stick some extra holes uh, in here to just snag it up a little bit and make it fit his little little head a little better um but yeah besides that i think uh yeah it works really well and uh he went pretty good in it uh you know it took a, a few minutes to get used to it but um because he's so used to being ridden bitless um he adapted really fast to it so uh, and i actually kept the reins on the lower ring uh, just because it was looser i felt like i could have a little bit more control and i wanted to see how it um how that <laughs> would work and i think it helped a little bit with uh his uh the keeping him collected and keeping him in a frame so yeah he's happy yeah good boy so uh yeah i hope you guys like this um and uh hopefully you can follow me and subscribe and there'll be more videos soon and Matt's gonna just give us some kisses, huh? Thanks, Mia. <laughs>